I'm Jane. I'm Ashaya. I'm Rachel. And we're from Thomas Jefferson. <laughs> Brock, Brock Turner. In your defense, your father stated that you were not the same after the, the incident. incident. You no longer had an appetite. Well, let us tell you something, Brocky boy. We lose our appetite every time we see your name in a headline. Every time we see another privileged white boy like yourself think he has the right to another person's body. Another boy like yourself would attempt to use alcohol as an excuse. Broccoli boy. <laughs> the fact that you are now lecturing others about excessive drinking makes me want to actually vomit. And that you believe you have the right to teach people about safe alcohol use when you can't even control your own penis is ludicrous. <laughs> Not Ludacris the rapper, because even he has more respect for women than you do. <laughs> Turn my stomach, Turner. When you receive six months out of a recommended six years, and only serve three months for good behavior, we, we lost, lost all faith in the U.S. justice system. system. So, so we were compelled to create a list of things that take longer than your stint in the big house. Getting a double cheeseburger at McDonald's. <laughs> Waiting to place your order at Starbucks. Making toast. <laughs> Waiting for my father to bring me my ribeye steak. Wow, even that list was longer. Brock, nice guy Turner. You think you're a nice guy, but, but if you have to say it, it mm, <laughs> probably not. Nice guys get drunk girls inside. Not get inside drunk girls. Brock Stanford Rapist Turner. The press refused to use your mugshot. Instead, they used your college ID photo. Tried to paint you as a misfortune star athlete that was in the wrong place at the wrong time. Tried to compare your place on the college swim team to the value of a human life. Tried to say you couldn't be a rapist because you were a good student. As if grades on a piece of paper determine the likeliness of committing a crime. And that's what you did, Brock. Commit a crime. You are not kind of, almost, sort of, a rapist. You are a rapist. It does not matter what your grades were. Or that you get to on the lap in X amount of time. Or that you're cannonballing into your daddy's money. Or that you are drowning in alcohol. You, you chose, chose to throw that all away when you chose to strip a woman of her identity. When you chose to make it hard for her to look in the mirror. Brock Turner. No matter how hard you try. She will never be your rape victim. She will never be defined by your crime. You will never be Brock Turner. You will always be a rapist. Oh, <laughs>